last year in Hematologica, there was a very interesting uh, study. So it's Gandelman in Hematologica to, to, uh, 2019. So it's a machine uh, learning uh, approach which analyzed the patients according to the NIH criteria. And then um, by this approach, identified uh, seven different phenotypes, which then could, which was not uh, identified before by clinicians, and which could be then uh, further uh, stratified in three risk, uh, three risk groups. And this is something which uh, so uh, an artificial intelligence revealed to us, and we were not aware of this uh, before. Which uh, of course makes us think that some of um, these approaches can help us in the future, because maybe some of these phenotypes types also share an underlying pathophysiological mechanism and could maybe share uh, the treatment approach as well. So this is also something very interesting, which is now today being used in many fields and in chronic GVHD as well.